Hey guys, what up? This is King Leviticus coming at you with another redstone tutorial. Uh, today we're going to be building my boiling smart cauldron, as you might have seen by the intro. This is just basically a cauldron with a fire underneath it, so it looks like it's boiling, which also features an infinite water source underneath every time it's activated. Uh, so let's take a look at what we're going to need. We're going to need all of these. So not too t not too much to ask for. These coloured walls are just for my uh, colour coding the circuits. So we'll grab our yellow and now all, all our redstone bits. Except for that, we'll put that away and grab that out. Cool. So we want to come to the middle and we want to bang down a comparator. Put our cauldron there and replace that with a block of choice. Cool, we'll come around to the back. Oh, we'll bring that out. I'm going to chuck a torch on here where that comparator is pointing into. With a repeater on one tick on top of that. Going into a block. Running into this block with dust underneath it. Cool, put that away and now we'll grab out our half slab. Come underneath and you place half slab there. Put the half slab off to the side of it, so it looks like that. Cool. Put a repeater on three tick delay. Cool. Going into this block. With dust underneath it. And a redstone torch there. Cool. Put our yellow away. So our butt switch in. Cool. So we come down here, two below this torch. Dust here. Actually, before we put the rest of the dust on, we'll just drag that out. Come up to here, up to the top. Bang out these blocks here. And that one, sorry. Cool. Come back down here. In this spot here, we're going to put a sticky piston facing towards us. Awesome. And this spot here is going to be a dispenser facing this way. Another dispenser facing this way and one more so that it should look like that and we don't need that block there sorry cool so we're going to come back down here and we're going to build this up to here we need a piece of nether rack sorry cool so grab some nether rack and that goes one below where the cauldron is break out that one that's where our dust is going to go break that because we don't need that Okay, our sticky pistons are going to latch onto here, so I'll just do it this way for now. So you don't need that. Awkward, awkward. Okay, one up there, cool. Come along, break off these bottom ones because we don't need them there. And you want to place a block of choice on top of them. Finish connecting up our redstone. We want a repeater on one tick delay going into that block with dust on it, and we want to connect it up with that dust. Cool. So there we go, our floors all up. Come back down here, and we'll put in our water circuit now. So where these pistons are, place a block on the edge of them. Cool. Delete that, it's not needed. A repeater here on four tick delay going into this block. Cool. Wrap that around there. Dust, dust. We want to place a torch here. And off this torch we're going to come out one, two, three, four. Break out these. Place a sticky piston with a block on it. And a block on top of this torch. Cool. Come down here, come down two. Break the middle one out, put a redstone torch there. Over here, we're going to come up here, break that, it's not needed. Connect this dust, run it into this block. So that will invert that torch. Cool. And same thing over this side. Come up to the edge of these pistons where that dispenser is there. And place it on there, block on there. Break that one, we don't need it. A repeater going into that block. On four tick delay. Cool. And we'll bring this out too. And one more this way. 
with a torch on there. Coming off that torch, one, two, three, four. Break these ones. Sticky piston facing towards the torch with a block on it and a block on top of the torch. Cool. Come down to this blue block and we want to break out the middle one here. Place a redstone torch there. Cool. We we'll want to hook this up to the green wire. So we run the redstone dust from there into that torch. I'll pull that back. Awesome. Okay, now we're going to put in our circuit to delete uh, the leftover water source if it is, isn't used. So out of this dust, a repeater on one tick delay. Running into that block there. Put that block below and dust on top of that. Cool. And down here we're going to put eight repeaters pointing in this direction, coming back towards the front of the machine. So that's three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And all of these we're going to put on maximum delay. So four tick delay for every one of them. Cool. There we go. And a piece of dust here with a block redstone torch block on top of that torch off to the side block on there torch off to the back another block and another torch one more block and one more torch and we'll come back up here and break that so it's not mono stabled replace it there okay so that's our delete water in now we will put our light the fire circuit in. So coming off where this torch is, where this block is here, place a block, another one, come up one, down one, delete the middle one. Going into this direction, we want to place a repeater, no, not that way. Going into that block on one tick delay, dust below that on top of that block. Come down here. And we'll bring this out six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Awesome. This is all going to be repeaters on maximum delay, pointing that direction. So there's two, three, four, five, six. And put them all on max delay. Oh, cool. Now we want to bring this up again. And so one up there. So the repeater's running into that block. Put dust on top of there. We want to place a block on the edge of that dust, so like that, with a torch on there, a block on top of that torch, and one more redstone torch. Awesome. <coughs> now, come over to here, we're going to fill up our dispensers with water, one bucket in each of these dispensers. This dispenser over here is going to be our fire chargers, so put a few in there. Cool, and now let's just test if this works. Grab out our water, fill up the cauldron. And it's a big fat no that it's not working. Why? Why you no go? Uh, fail, I see why. So when you're building yours, make sure you put a block on top of that torch. Cool, and now it lights the fire. So we'll quickly just chuck this away now. I'll show you how to cover it up. I'm going to place carpet on top of these so that you can... Uh, wow, I'm confused. There we go. There we go. I've got this pen sussed. So you just place carpet on top so that it helps blend it in a bit, I suppose. So you can't see the pistons or dispenser. Cool. Alternate that with the white. Dun, dun, dun. Cool. There we go. It's all covered up now. Over here, you usually put it like, I don't know, pis pistons or uh, piston, sorry, furnaces. I don't know, you could put a cr crafting table there, I suppose. Oops. Chuck some chests down if you wanted. It's up to you how you want to decorate it. But anyways, grab out a bottle, not throw it away, grab out a bottle, 
And each time the water level in this cauldron changes, it's going to open up below here, infinite water source, so you can take some water to refill your cauldron as you see fit. And it's going to always light it for you also, every time you use it. Very cool. How oh, well guys? If you enjoyed the tutorial, please show some love by leaving a comment below, leaving a like, and subscribe for more. Cheers guys.